Hope you've had a wonderful day. Uh, the GOAT, greatest of all time. Uh, in Major League Baseball, pitchers, I think of Nolan Ryan, seven no-hitters, the closest behind him, uh, Sandy Koufax with four. Um, NFL quarterbacks, uh, Tom Brady. Uh, last weekend, he had his 55th game-winning drive, setting a new record, seven Super Bowl wins. Uh, golf, I think of Jack Nicklaus, 18 majors. Tiger Woods, 15 majors. Um, thinking of boxing, in fact, it was interesting. I was at my sister-in-law's house one day, and they had a coffee table with us. You know how sometimes we have the big books or magazines or whatever they put on the coffee tables? They're just kind of presentation uh, books. Uh, this thing was huge. It was like two feet by 18 inches, and it was like four inches thick. And on the cover, it was white, and on the cover said GOAT, G-O-A-T, and you open it up, and it's a photo essay of Muhammad Ali. Um, John Wooden, uh, NCAA basketball coaches, 88 consecutive wins, 10 out of 12 uh, national championships, Final Four wins. Uh, our minds flow in all different kinds of directions when we think of greatness, those that have achieved. Um, but there is an achieved greatness, but there also can be a received greatness. Uh, listen to what Jesus says in Mark chapter 10, 43 to 45. He says, if you want to be great, be a servant. Receive the challenge. Receive the opportunity. Take advantage of it. If you want to be the greatest, the goat, the first among the great, then be the slave of all. For Jesus said about himself, for the Son of Man did not come to be served but to serve and to give his life a ransom for many. Two chapters later, Mark chapter 12, 28 to 31, Greatness, the greatest commandment is to love God with your heart, soul, mind, and strength. The second is like it, love your neighbor as yourself. So let me just encourage you today, uh, while maybe none of us will, as it were in the world's eyes, achieve greatness, uh, we can receive a kind of greatness into our lives as we do what? As we love God, love others, and serve those around us. I like to put it this way, hearts moved with compassion. We love God and love others as we serve and as we help. Wow. Receive the great opportunity of true spiritual greatness. Hope you've had a wonderful day. God bless you. Have a good evening.